So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome to Dead Man's Journey. This game looked really, really awesome guys. And it's made by the same guy who did Continuous and also Continuously, which I think were really, really cool games. They were both inspired by like a PT-esque theme where you'd like walk through the same room over and over again. And I'm hoping as well that over the years, because I think it's been about a year since he last made the Continuous games, that this might be another one in a similar fashion with improved concept. And as well guys, I'm going to actually link a video I made about a year ago where I played Continuous Man so you guys can see how I've changed my style over the years because it's quite dramatic and I'm glad I have. Whoa, talk about dramatic. We ran straight in that room with no idea what was in next. It's dark. Okay, so please adjust the volume until you can very slightly hear a beeping sound. You've committed a major sin. Whoa, okay. That you stand between the heavens and hell. Oh, okay. Up ahead, you will be reminded of your worst memories. Okay. Thoughts. And experiences. And this is why humans oh, should never breed with dogs. Uh, dogs, you. frogs. <laughs> I think so, Mr. Frog Human Man thing. Yeah, I'm ready. Woo, okay. Ooh, lovely animation. I like these cutscenes when they actually start that way. Hey, so where the heck are we? When hanging in between life and death, heaven and hell, one can only do but remind himself over and over. I guess what we have here is possibly a small, like, kind of uh, riddle slash synopsis of what's going on here. Okay, the door is beeping. I guess this is the... What the... What the freak is going on? Whoa, okay. Oh, hang on a minute. I can see things inside there. Can we walk? Okay, that's pretty damn cool. I thought that was like a doorway then. Whoa, it, whoa, okay. So just the game brightness through the number keys one to nine. One being the darkest and most recommended. So I'm going to have this on seven so you guys can also see the different things throughout our experience playing this one. This is what appears to be maybe some kind of storage facility, I guess. I mean, it's got kind of chemical waste and things like that. Maybe roadworks because it's got all the different things that seem to make up that, you know, we got the things to stop cars driving. High voltage, authorized personnel only. Oh, there's a different way we can actually go through this small thing here. I wonder if it was like a construction worker. We haven't another door here. Let's just try this one and see if we can open this one. Again, no interaction can be actually added or enabled. All right, and we're back here. All right, so that's probably just to get us used to everything. And I guess we've got to stand a little bit clear because the door is going to... Yep, I knew this was going to happen. So it's just like another PTS game, which is absolutely amazing and fantastic for me. So we can't go the other way again, or at least we can, but there's nothing that's changed just yet. So what about if we go down here? Okay, 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 okay. Okay. I think saying we're alone might be a bit of a lie. And I guess that the uh, the noise that was just coming from those guys then was them two falling over just there. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. The thing about this guy's work is I remember his sound design. It's not the best, but that's what makes it even better. I don't know what makes it like so good. It's like that little hum in the background. I don't, it just makes the game. It gives me tingles down my friggin' spine, man. Okay, things seem to be a little bit more in order actually this time around, which is interesting. Don't really see anything. Nothing seems to have changed. I guess, was there something I should, hold on a minute. Okay, I can't interact with that just yet. Okay, that's not good. And I say that with certainty. That is really not good. Ah! Oh! Jeez! That gave me a complete cold sweat. Danger. Do not leave door opened or unlocked. I see why. I understand. Wow. I regret having the sound as loud as I do right now. That was really, really, really loud. I ain't changing it though. Oh no. Okay. Let's keep going, let's keep going, let's keep going. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! 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 Okay, 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 come here! Ah, the door doesn't open! Okay, okay, okay. Right, I think the best thing to do is get out of this one really quick. Shut. Listen! 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 Oh! Okay! Yeah, you can scream. No, actually, no. I'm not going to scream back louder. I'm going to keep my eyes on this door this time. Okay. Okay. Okay, Mr. Breathing Dragon Fiery Thing of Weirdness. We're going to leave you there. That door closing is just... Oh, that's a beautiful sight. That's all I'm going to say. Okay, we have this now, like, constant droney ambience. I don't know what's happened here or what that guy is. It's a dead man's journey. I need to remember the motive behind this game. So it's something to do with death and being on the life and death like... <laughs> That 
It's red! <laughs> Hello. Oh no. Oh no. Press E to pick up the camera. The camera. Press and hold left click to activate night vision. Release left click to deactivate night, night vision. Okay. Mm. Mm. Uh-uh. Uh-huh. 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 Uh. -huh. uh, -huh. uh, -huh. uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Two three two eight three Bradle Eagle Doctor Southwest. Hang on, let me just read the paper again. Two X six no dog. Kill them, A. Ah! 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 Oh, oh my god, that's three times in like seven minutes. Both mother and son died tragically in the hands of the father. Police arrived at a home on Thursday night after a worried neighbor called in to report excessive screaming. Upon police forcefully entering the home, both believed to be mother and son were brutally murdered. With the father nowhere to be found, full-on investigation have begun on the take on take play. Something like that. <laughs> uh, should I? Oh my goodness, is this my- is this me? Did I do that? Oh my goodness, this is really bad. This guy really knows how to do horror well. He does, he does it all the time very well. We can actually see in this room here, there doesn't seem to be anything in there particularly. Whoa! Oh, let's just go to the door! Really? Nothing? Are you kidding me? Nothing? Really? Oh no, oh! Oh no 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 come on This is the problem this guy knows how to do sound Okay 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 that door is closed that door is closed I have my back to the Oh my god what's this is a different note September 03 2006 That was so easy I worried nothing that little effort got in my Shirt dirty though. Things burn perfectly at 500 degrees. 7793, whatever that means. Upon investigating, police determined that husband of Claire Rin and father of Robert cut Claire into pieces to later stuff her into the oven along with her son? Okay, we've got a cannibal here. While alive? It has been over 20 years since such horrific act took place. Many neighbors still in shock attempting to sell their property with no luck. Police who witnessed the results require therapy. Whatever the heck happened then? They must have really seen. Yes? You, to us! With the camera. Damn. Ah, okay! How did I do that? This is like purgatory, man. Come on! I'm trapped. I don't know what that freaking lanky thing is. Okay, right, let me try and center the thoughts, okay? Happy music in the background right now. I'm flying in the clouds or something like that, okay? I'm ex- Oh, for- To hell with it, I'm not. I'm just- Please. I gotta go back on myself. I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna go head first into this. Oh, okay. Okay. Night vision on, night vision on. Okay. Okay. Round this corner. It's here. Something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen, definitely. Okay. Uh, use the keyboard to type numbers. Uh, what was the number that was three? Oh, was it 2773? 7793. I was right with the sevens and the three, so 7793. So 7793. Okay, the door's opened. It's kind of kind of comfy in there, isn't it? You know, just uh, room for one, one only, not two. Especially seven foot strange looking people. Freaking creep. In we go. In we go. Okay, uh, press E to reset. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah, yep, yeah, yeah, the the actress, yeah, uh, yep, 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 mm, yeah, mm, yeah, ah, uh, yeah, yeah, ah, uh, yeah, yeah, what the freak, man? What the freak? What the heck? Oh boy, that guy looks kind of weird. I can't believe this isn't over yet. I can't wait till this is over. This is really horrible. I'm gonna have to rush through this, man. I am so panicked right now. Hang on, this wasn't red last time, was it? So we can't go right. So we're actually restricted here. Oh, this makes it even worse. Oh wait, hang on. Oh, hang on a minute. Ah! I get it. I get it. I get it. It's the sound of the murder. Okay. Okay, we did that. We did this. Okay. 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 
Okay, okay. Oh god, oh god. Father of the murdered family has been sentenced to death after constant cries of innocence. Upon further investigation, it is concluded that young Amy Rin stayed at her grandparents overnight of the massacre, and John Rin remains missing since five years ago. Grandparents say he ran away from his house at 16 years old. You framed that man. I did? Whoa, hold on. I die for you. Whoa. Purely unpleasant. Okay, now that's disturbing. December 24th, 1995. Got my new phone. Mom, finally bought me my phone. My phone number is 419-948-7793. My brother was, was born in 1977 and my sister in 1993. Those years I would never forget. So 1977 and 1993. I don't know why. I feel like I've got to remember that. I kind of expected it on that occasion. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> I mean, the monster's really derpy, but... Ah! Ah! What's this? What's this? What's this? I'm so sorry. I'll die tomorrow to be with you. I promise. I promise. Okay. Okay. Can we just interact? Oh, it's a different place. Is it? No, wait. We're going back on us. He's done this game well. He's done a great job on this. September 4th, 2006. I had no idea it was them. I hadn't seen them for six years. How could I forget their faces so soon? The things I've done to them, how I killed them, it's impossible to live on. You didn't realize there was a family with those, didn't you? Wait, because we ran away? Mother, your brother, and even your father. What? Luckily, your sister was spared. Well, okay. Oh, man. In the end, you shot yourself. <laughs> I took the coward's way out. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. I uh, kind of like it down here anyway. You know, this freaking lights are noisy, man. This is it. This is it. We're trapped in solitary con. Just uh, tidy my fringe just a second here. Okay. Is that us? Oh, man. No wonder we shot ourselves. Good grief. Look at us. On the toilet as well? Damn. Oh. 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 Oh! What the heck is this? Well, this game is really, really cool. I'm liking this game. So is this like purgatory? Mother, brother, and father. Dead by your own hands. Wow, okay. Now you're here. On the edge of both heaven and hell. Interesting, which will probably explain. Well, I know where I belong, my friend. I don't know, it's almost like the contrast between the white. We was disgusting, man. That was so disturbing of us. Why would we do such a thing? I get it! I get it, man! Okay, plot twist inbound? Your hunger for money. Your overexcessive greed took over you. Assuming, with them all dead, you would be left to will. Always money. Wake up, John. They all thought you were dead six years ago. Why in the hell did they give you a will? That's very true. That is so true. He cheated himself when he found this out. He took everything from them. He received nothing. Selfish. That's what he is. All for money. Killed his own family for money. Do this, I ask you. Which do you deserve? Is it my choice? Uh, I, I say hell. Hell? It's not every day someone is willing to choose to Dude, among hell. Dude, we deserve it though. Suppose you truly do believe that you've done wrong. Yeah. <laughs> you surprised me, John. You truly are a unique individual. You can say that again. Look at our face. Hold, I cast it and let you off. I agree. Indeed, you will be going to hell. No doubt. No, not for eternity. Really? Whoa! Spend a large portion of time. Constantly moving through your memories, as you had already done. Wow. Though, this time, your deeper emotions will be accessed and presented upon you. Whoa, okay. Once you have gone through what you deserve, I will then judge you once more to decide whether an eternal stay at heaven or hell will be best suited for you. Whoa. So this With is that it. that said, this is the last time I will be speaking to you for quite some time. Whoa, okay. I wish you luck, John. Whoa, okay, that's pretty cool. That is pretty damn cool. Wow, okay. Now that is good, now that is good. What can I say?
Definitely an improvement. So as the credits roll, guys, I just want to say definitely a big improvement over continuous and continuously. Like, there's direct storyline entwined within this one. And it's good story as well. So I am really, really thankful that I actually played this game. And um, I don't regret it one bit. Wow, awesome. So guys, if you did enjoy this video, why not drop me that like button? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? And of course, guys, more amazing indie games. So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I, of course, hope you did enjoy... And I will, of course, see you on the next one.